In this video, we'll balance the net ionic equation for Na2S plus HCl. This is sodium sulfide plus hydrochloric acid. We end up with sodium chloride, a salt, in H2S, which is a gas. It smells like rotten eggs. It's really nasty. So let's balance the net ionic equation. First, we balance the molecular equation. So I have two sodiums here, just one. Let's put a two here. Now I have two chlorines. Put a two here. That balances the chlorines. Two hydrogens, two hydrogens. That's the molecular equation. Now we need to write the state for each substance. Sodium compounds are very soluble. You put them in water, they dissolve, split into their ions. That's going to be aqueous. HCl, one you should remember, a strong acid. It'll dissociate completely. Sodium chloride, sodium compounds, again, very soluble. And then H2S, that is a gas. So we have our states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions. And this will give us the complete ionic equation. Sodium group 1 has a 1 plus charge. Sulfide ion is 2 minus. So I have Na plus, And the subscript means I have two of them. And then I have just the one sulfide ion. And I'll write aqueous at the end. Let's not do that right now. Plus hydrogen and then chlorine. So I have two hydrogen ions plus the two chloride ions. And these are the reactants in our net ionic equation. Products, we have a plus and minus, so we have two sodium ions again, plus the two goes to everything, so we have two chloride ions. And we don't split gases apart in net ionic equations, that just stays H2S. So this is the complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out spectator ions. They're on both sides of the complete ionic equation. They haven't changed, so we're really not interested in them. Here's our reactants, and here's our products. I can see there's two sodium ions here, and then in the products. We don't need those. Two chloride ions, again in the products. So what's left, that's the net ionic equation for Na2S plus HCl. I'll clean this up and add the states in. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for sodium sulfide plus hydrochloric acid. You'll note that charge is conserved. We have 2 minus here, 2 times 1 plus, that's 2 plus. They give us a net charge of 0, and over here we have a neutral compound net charge of 0. Atoms are also conserved. We have 1 sulfur, 1 sulfur, 2 hydrogen atoms, 2 hydrogen atoms. So this is the balanced net ionic equation. Sometimes you'll see the positive ion written first. It doesn't matter. It's the same equation. Maybe it looks a little nicer. I don't know. Either way, this is the net ionic equation for Na2S plus HCl. And this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.